<clears throat> what a crazy old broad. Why? Because she believes in ghosts? <laughs> Look at you sticking up for your girlfriend, you cougar, huh? Bite me. But not if she bites you first. <laughs> so who's this Alex? We get another player in town? Maybe, maybe not. That'd change our job. And we'll take a ghost ship, right? Yeah, it's not the first one's been sighted on that either. Really? Yeah, every 37 years, like clockwork, reports of a vanishing three-masted clipper ship out in the bay. And every 37 years, a rash of weirdo dry land drownings. So whatever's happening is just getting started? Yeah. What's the lore? Well, there are apparitions of old wrecks sighted all over the world. The SS Violet, the Griffin, the Flying Dutchman, almost all of them are death omens. So what happens? You see the ship, and then a few hours later, you fuck her up and kiss your ass goodbye? Basically. What's the next step? I gotta ID the boat. It shouldn't be too hard. I mean, how many three mass clipper ships have wrecked off the coast? I checked that too, actually. Over 150. Wow. Yeah. Crap. Mm -hmm. This is where we parked the car, right? I thought so. Where's my car? Did you feed the meter? Yes, I fed the meter. Sam, where's my car? Somebody stole my car! Hey, 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 calm down. Dean. I am calm down. Somebody stole my car. Whoa, Dean. Hey, 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 hey. Take it easy. Take it easy. 67 Impala? Was that yours? Bella. I'm sorry. I had that car towed. You what? Well, it was in a tow way, No, it wasn't. It was when I finished with it. What the hell are you even doing here? I'm in yachting. You're Alex. You're working with that old lady. Gert's a dear old friend. Yeah, right. What's your angle? There's no angle. There's a lot of lovely old women like Gert up and down the eastern seaboard. I sell them charms, perform seances so they can commune with their dead cats. And let me guess, it's all a con, none of it's real. The comfort I provide them is very real. How do you sleep at night? On silk sheets, rolling naked in money. Really, Sam. I'd expect the attitude from him, but you? You shot me. I barely grazed you. Cute. Did a bit of drama queen, yeah? You do know what's going on around here. This ghost ship thing, it is real. I'm aware. Thanks for telling Gert the case wasn't solved, by the way. It isn't. She didn't know that. Now the old bag stopped paying and she's demanding some real answers. Look, just stay out of my way before you cause any more trouble. And I'd get to that car if I were you. Before they find the arsenal in the trunk. Ciao. Can I shoot her? Not in public. No, the police said that he drowned, but I don't understand how... I am so sorry for your loss, Mr. Lorraine. Now, if you could just tell me one more time about the ship your brother saw. Ma'am, I think this man's been through quite enough. You should go. But I just have a few more questions. No, you don't. Thank you for your time. Sorry you had to deal with that. They're like roaches. So, uh, we heard you said your brother saw a ship. Yeah, that's right. Did he tell you what it looked like? It was, uh, like the old Yankee Clippers. A smuggling vessel. A rakish topsail, a barking team rigging. 
Angel figurehead on the bow. That's a lot of detail for a ship your brother saw. My brother and I were night diving. I saw the ship too. Um, all right, well, we'll be in touch. Thank you. I see you got your car back. You really want to come near me when I got a loaded gun in my hands? No, I your blood pressure. Why are you even still here? You have enough to ID the boat. Yeah. That guy back there saw the ship. Yeah, and? And he's going to die. So we have to save him. Oh, sweet. You think this is funny? He's cannon fodder. He can't be saved in time, and you know it. Yeah, well, see, we have souls, so we're gonna try. Yeah, well, I'm actually gonna find the ship and put an end to this. But you have fun. Hey, Bella, how'd you get like this, huh? What, did Daddy not give you enough odds or something? I don't know. Your Daddy give you enough? Don't you dare look down your nose at me. You're no better than I am. We help people. Come on. You do this out of vengeance and obsession. You're a stone's throw from being a serial killer. Whereas I, on the other hand, I get paid to do a job and I do it. So you tell me, which is healthier? Bella, why don't you just leave? We've got work to do. Yeah, you're 0 for 2. Bang up jobs so far. Calm down, please. You guys aren't cops. Not just like that, not, not in that crappy car. Oh, hey, no need to get nasty. We are cops, okay? We're undercover. We're here because we think you're in danger. From who? If you just settle down, we'll talk about it. But you guys just stay away from me. <laughs> Wait. Hey, you moron, we're trying to help you. That can't be good. No. It's all good. Oh. 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 Oh.